morning friends. Hi, it's Miss Celeste from Chickadee and I am sending you this video to, to let you know that I love you and I miss you and that we're going to be spending some time with our families over the next couple weeks so we won't be seeing each other. And I want to share my love and to let you know that I'll be sending you some videos so that we can still spend some time together even though we're spending time apart. And this morning I thought I would read one of our stories that we love at school called The Invisible String because it talks about how we are all connected to the people we love by what they call as an invisible string. And we know the invisible string is really a connection made out of love, just like the necklace that I wear. And so these children are learning from their mom that even when you're far apart from each other, you can still be connected by the love that you share with the people that you care about. And so let's get started. We'll read our story. Okay. The Invisible String by Patrice Karst. To the children of the world and their magic of their strings. Liza and Jeremy the twins were asleep one calm and quiet night. Suddenly it began to rain very hard. Thunder rumbled until it got so loud that it woke them up. Mommy, mommy, they cried as they ran out to her. Don't worry you two, it's just the storm making all those noises. Let's go back to bed. We don't want to go back to bed. We want to stay out here with you, said Jeremy. We're feeling scared. Oh, Mom said, you know what? We're always together, even when we're apart, no matter what. But how can we be together when you're out here and we're in our beds, said Liza. Mom held out something right in front of them and said, this is how. Rubbing their sleepy eyes, the twins came closer to see what mom was holding. I was about your age when my mom first told me about the invisible string. I don't see a string, said Jeremy. You don't need to see the invisible string. People who love each other are always connected by a very special string made out of love. But if you can't see it, how do you know it's there? asked Liza. Even though you can't see it with your eyes, you can feel it with your heart and know that you are always connected to the people that you love. When you're at school and you miss me, your love travels all the way along the string until I feel it tug on my heart. And when you tug it right back, we feel it in our hearts, said Jeremy. Does Jasper the cat have an invisible string, Liza asked. She sure does, Mom said. And best friends, like me and Lucy, best friends too. How far can the string reach? Anywhere and everywhere, said Mom. Wow, that's far. Would it reach me even if I were a submarine captain deep at the bottom of the ocean? asked Jeremy. Even there, said Mom. Or a mountain climber on the top of the tallest mountain? Even there. How about a ballerina in France? asked Liza. Even there, said Mom. Or a jungle explorer? Even there. How about an astronaut in outer space? Yes, said Mom, even there. Then Jeremy quietly asked, 